the slow up, no I don't take shit, I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit, I got no love We're talking about something incredibly important, stroke it's sudden, it's serious, and it can happen to anyone. But the more we know, the better we can prevent it or save a life. So let's break it down. What is a stroke? Who gets it? Can we see it coming? And if it does happen, can you recover? Let's dive in. 1. What is a stroke? A stroke happens when blood flow to a part of the brain is interrupted, either due to a blockage or bleeding. There are two main types. One ischemic stroke caused by a blood clot blocking a vessel 2. hemorrhagic stroke caused by a blood vessel bursting without blood brain cells start dying within minutes this is why stroke is considered a medical emergency 2. who gets stroke you might think stroke only affects the elderly but that's not entirely true yes people over 65 are at higher risk but young adults and even children can have strokes too the risk goes up if you have high blood pressure, diabetes, high cholesterol, atrial fibrillation, if you smoke or drink excessively, and let's not forget, genetics and lifestyle choices play a big role too. 3. Can we tell before it strikes? Unfortunately, a stroke often hits without warning, but the body sometimes gives us clues. Remember the acronym FAST, which simply means face drooping, arm weakness, speech difficulty, time to call emergency services. If you or someone else shows these signs, don't wait. Every second counts. Some people may also feel sudden confusion, loss of balance, or vision changes. Don't ignore the signs. 4. How do we treat it? Treatment depends on the type of stroke. For an ischemic stroke, doctors may use a clot-busting drug called TPA, but it has to be given within a few hours of symptom onset. For hemorrhagic strokes, surgery may be needed to stop the bleeding and relieve pressure. The sooner treatment starts, the better the chances of survival and recovery. 5. Can one recover from it? Yes, recovery is possible. It can be slow and every journey is different. Some may recover completely. Others may deal with long-term effects like speech difficulties, paralysis or memory loss. Rehabilitation is key. This may include physical therapy speech therapy, occupational therapy, and emotional support. 6. How can one prevent it? Now the good news, stroke is largely preventable. Here's how you can lower your risk. Keep blood pressure and sugar levels in check. Eat a healthy diet. Exercise regularly. Quit smoking, limit alcohol, manage stress, get regular health checkups. And if you're at high risk, Talk to your doctor about medications or lifestyle changes that could help. Stroke can change a life in an instant, but knowing the signs, acting fast, and taking care of your health can make all the difference. If this video helped you understand stroke a little better, give it a like, share it with someone who might need it, and don't forget to subscribe for more health insights. Take care of your brain, it's the only one you've got.